The project for this week was to show your favorite kitchen appliance and make something using it. My favorite kitchen appliance is my oven. And I made two layers of ginger nut s'mores. When they are cool, I will put the filling in the middle of them, cut a piece, and enjoy. Because if they taste as good as my kitchen smells, with this ginger aroma, they should taste delicious. Good morning, Let's Talk. I am here in my kitchen, and I am sharing with you one of my favorite appliances that I use at least three times a week. This is my rice cooker. I just put any type of rice on in here, put what type of rice it is, and get it started, and it will cook, it will turn itself off, and it will keep the rice warm. So today, I have cooked some yellow rice. I have some yellow rice for supper today, and I did enough, so I'll be able to get some vegetable fried rice out of this. Some yellow rice cooked in one of my favorite, if not my favorite kitchen appliance, my rice cooker. Good day ladies. In this grinder, I have some roots. I'm going to grind some turmeric. I have turmeric, I have ginger, and a little garlic. I'm going to make my immune booster for the, for the weekend. going to add some lemon juice to it. The water is boiling on the stove so everything is going to seep in the water and this I'm going to drink uh, maybe twice per day to, to boost my system. One of my favorite appliances that I like to use on a regular basis is the blender. Now today I am going to make some green smoothie. So I have set out all of my ingredients already. I'm going to now put my spinach. I have some cut up strawberries here that I'm also going to add to my green smoothie. I have some cut up bananas also that I'm going to add. I'm also going to add a tin of pineapple juice to my smoothie. And also, I'm going to put some ice Make it chilled and nice. Now I'm going to add a little bit of honey just for some sweetener. I'm going to blend again. And my smoothie is ready. This is my green smoothie that I have made. This is really good. Really refreshing. Hello ladies of um, Let's Talk. Our project this week is to show our favorite appliance in the kitchen. This is my favorite appliance. It's a kitchen aid. Um, I do all my baking with this. I use this to do all my baking, all my blending and stuff. So what I'm doing today, I'm doing a cake. I'm doing some cupcakes. So I'm using a package. This is a strawberry cupcake that I'm doing. And it calls for a half a cup of oil one cup of water and three eggs. Now I'm going to blend it up, locking it. I'm going to have a regular speed for now. Turn it off, unlock it, and that's my um. I'm going to take off the head, put the, cup, the mixture in the cupcake using you know, a ice cream scoop. I'm gonna try and get 18. That's the use of my KitchenAid. Um, 
I'll get back to you when the cake when the cupcakes are finished. Bye. Good afternoon, let's talk. Demi, the semi-homemade lady here, and I'd like to introduce you to one of the best appliances in my kitchen, which is my Hobbleton Beach bread maker. So this is our bread maker, Hamilton Beach. Yes, we are semi-homemade in the turn semi-homemade in the turnquest home. So our first ingredient will be Joshua, and he'll be putting in one the water. One cup of water. So you're gonna pour that right in there for me. One tablespoon of oil. So we have another little helper here, Daniel. Yes, and you are going to be putting in how much salt, Daniel? One teaspoon, One teaspoon of salt. Awesome. So I have another helper. This is Noah, and Noah will be putting in three cups of flour, right? Shake it all in. Two teaspoons of yeast. Just like that. Good stuff. So as we prepare our flour for our pizza, we're going to close the lid. We're going to pick our cycle. Awesome. And then we're going to press. What are we going to press, guys? This one. I can't Start. So press the start button. Awesome sauce. We'll see you in an hour. But awesome. And they enjoyed it. So this is my favorite appliance in my kitchen. My Hamilton Beach Bread Maker. <laughs>